go no we are not going out like that all right one last last one wow that was an awful game <laughs> All right. One more time for the kids. One more time. And yeah, while this will be the last time we donate for Tetris, uh, we do have the big marathon happening this Saturday, November 2nd. Starting at 9 a.m. Eastern Time, my friends, family, and I are all coming to the house. We're playing games together online, and we're going to have a great time. And I hope you can make it as well. We're going to be on all 25 hours, so at some point, hopefully there is some time in your day where you can tune in. And of course, if, you, if there's anything you can spare, 100% um, of the proceeds go towards the Children's Miracle Network of Hospitals link up in the top right hand corner of your screen also at the in below at the in my twitch page Doo -doo -doo. Mm, speaking of twitch um what do you guys think about shroud going over to mixer of course shroud a I think best known for Fortnite. Another one of the top streamers as well. Twitch pulling out the or Mixer, Microsoft pulling out the Brinks truck trying to scoop up top talent. Um do you think this is this strategy is going to work for Microsoft poaching the big streamers from Twitch? Is it going to do enough to move the needle for them? I'm curious to see. I find at this point in streaming's life that the Twitch community is very loyal to Twitch. I think that when you look at Ninja's numbers right now, they aren't nearly close to what they used to be because he's not on Twitch. And a lot of people loved watching him on Twitch and they don't want to leave their platform, they don't want to leave uh, their usernames behind, all the subs that they have there. Um, even if they're, that means they don't get to watch their favorite creator. That's really interesting, the, the platform loyalty there. And I wonder if this is going to be enough to get people to, I think, be more platform agnostic. Fake, fake Ghost Pirate Robot says, once they have Ninja and Shroud playing a duo, in a new Halo game, it's worth it. Ah, yep, that's the one of the other big uh, strategic boons for Microsoft is that they can get them to promote Halo stuff, presumably. We don't know the particulars of the deal. I'm guessing that's part of the deal, especially since Ninja himself was a pro Halo player before Fortnite happened. So that's probably something he would have wanted to do anyway. And yeah, the name recognition could could go a long way towards helping sell copies of. I guess it's Halo Six now. I I I don't know. All right, top forty. Yeah, I'm curious to see where all of this goes and where the landscape of streaming goes. Um, I think it's a fascinating world of so many people trying to make it big and what it actually takes to get there is really tough. And I saw some really interesting stats. I use a site called twitchtracker.com which allows you to look at kind of bigger stats about 
channels as a whole. But you can also look at individual streamer stats as well. So like if you wanted to creep on me and see how my channel is performing, you can do that. And I don't, I'm not sure what's going to happen after this stream. But based on like average views in the last month or so, in my last set of streams, uh, I was actually ranked. I'm in like the top. 2% of streamers on Twitch. It was like top 2.7 something. Like in the top 100,000. And on one hand, like, hey, that's amazing. I'm in the top 2% of streamers on Twitch. On the other hand, like, that translates to 10 people a stream watching me. And hey, like, 10 people's amazing. But at the same time, when we think about, like, the biggest streamers and the people who make a living off this, we think about people who have hundreds or thousands of people watching their stream. And I'm somehow in the top 2% and get, you know, at best double digits. And just really goes to show, like, the inequality of the platform and how difficult it is to really cut through. Like, there are what, 4 million active monthly streamers these days? And if I'm in the top 2% and still uh, averaging, like, single to double digit streams, like, it's crazy. It really shows, like, how much further you have to go before you can, like, really make this a thing. I think if, you're, if your goal is to, like, turn this into a full-time career, you've got to be, like, in the top 0.1% and that's a handful of people who are doing it that big right now. All right, top 10. Can we get to top five? A7. For the kids, six, one more, one more. All right, top five, we did it. All right, can we get to, like, can we close out this campaign on a bang? A first place would be amazing. There we go, okay. Can we get that storybook ending for the kids here? Ah. Ooh, that was a really bad drop. Mm. Okay. Ooh. Top two. Here comes the, the onslaught. How much can we weather this storm? All right. Yeah, he's hit me with some punches here, but not not like haymakers. I'm able to counter this. Go, go, go. I can't see what their board looks like. Their board is not looking their board's looking kind of rough right now. There we go! There we go. The Sheepdog, welcome. Um, IKIDU12, hype, you got this. Player 2 start with the... Thank you, thank you, we did it, we did it. Sheepdog came in right at the, at the right time. There we go, yes, number one, number one. JW Tetris, LOL, nice, thank you. Also welcome. Alright, let's go make one last donation to Extra Life. As I've said, for every win, I'm donating $10 to Extra Life. And let's shout out everybody here in the moment, right? So, 
Heck yeah. All right, so if your name, yeah, if you want want shout out, uh, throw in a message here real quick. I can see a bunch like Sheepdog and. You know what? Let, since this is the last one, let's make it big. Let's double it. I'm throwing in twenty bucks. Twenty bucks. Add a message. Shout out to Adventure Rules, JW Tetris, uh, the Sheepdog. Um, what's your in-game Tetris 99 name? Uh, it's Jet. J-E-T-T. -T. The Sheepdog. I don't know if that's an L or an I. I'm gonna guess it's an I. I-K-I-D-U-D-E-12. Um, let's throw it in for Cedric as well. Cedric and George. George, yes, Laura. Yeah, sure, the whole crew. We'll donate $20, make it one big one. Boom. Got it. Also, I see that my computer, the Extra Life page has been running the the stream. There we go. 20 bucks. One more big one. Mine is Jake. 21st level. Okay, cool. I will... We'll have to set it up. I, I know we can do, like, countdown streams and stuff where everyone can join in. Uh, Shout outs to Adventure Rules, JW Tetris, <laughs> to be the honest, Sheepdog, let me update my ticker 12, one more time. Cedric, Geo, uh, so Yolora. we donated 20 here. Um, Tetris 99 message. Let's make that 30 bucks. Uh, hold on. So that brings us to... Not including the donations from everybody else. I Yeah, we had one from uh, Mechanical... Man, that name, Mechanical C Thief Spectre. I'm pretty sure I know who you are. Donation from uh, Randy, donations. Donations from Randy, donations from literally Tony. We've raised like over 150 bucks during this campaign uh, for the Children's Miracle Network of Hospitals, which is fantastic. And we're not done yet. We've got one more big marathon happening Saturday, November the 2nd. And we're going to be playing a whole bunch of different games. Uh, Super Mario Maker 2, Jackbox 6. Uh, where do you donate? Uh, the, there's a link. Uh, here, I will send you the link in the chat as well. If you are interested in making a donation. I should have my bot throw that in there as well. But on screen, uh, top left hand corner. Uh, where am I pointing at? Over here. <laughs> Over here. Uh, Bitly slash Jet2019 or the channel... Um, link below. You'll donate. Awesome, JW Tetris. Thank you so much uh, for your support. 